Alrighty, now I went down and I got myself one of these things that are called a wind turbine generator. Now, <clears throat> I've spent a lot of money on what is just basically car alternator adapted kits and a few of them that were other products. And I figured for 180 or 90 bucks, whatever it was, I could just get me one of these little wind turbine generators. Now this is for my travel trailer and it could work and I'm going to put it up on the shop and let it run for a while and see what it does before I put it on my special telescopic pole for my travel trailer. And I've got my supervisor, Anna. Yep. And you talk about paying attention. So, of course I bring out my Missouri Pig sticker and we're going to cut this sucker open just like you supposed to with a Missouri pig sticker and uh, we're gonna take a look see and see if uh, anything is special or, or significant here now these are just cheap little wind turbines but I got a guy that lives down in Nevada south of me he bought one and he says Hey man, honestly, <laughs> for what you're paying for those three or four hundred dollar ones that you're getting off of eBay, this thing puts out 10, 12 amps in the same winds that those are putting out 10, 12 amps. So why in the hell spend all the money? It's hardware. So it comes with. Um, well, two so far. <laughs> two blades so far, and. Let's hope there's more inside, huh? <laughs> and, uh, I don't know if it's two blades worth of hardware here, but okay. Now, oh, there's the other blade. Now, he did say that he would take this out of the box and test it, so apparently that's why it's sitting like it is. Or maybe that's how they ship them. So you're looking at this and you're seeing, okay, that's all this is, is the... Um, wind turbine generator owner's manual I might be in it could even be in Chinglish which is a abridged version and then let me set my Missouri pig sticker aside here and take a look see here so pretty pretty simple stuff I'm sure and I'm sure it says great our thou and and you can do super and things like that so now this is an eBay special pretty simple stuff it's not a big wind turbine it's only about a 200 watt wind turbine pretty good little nose cone actually and it is a that is the brand or the style or whatever you want to call it and um, well it's actually freaking heavy so let's see here that's a yeah that's that that nut is turned down on it so it is actually turning the shaft I don't know if you can see that and everybody says check <clears throat> check these for play very solid not moving around at all and has some kind of little spacer or doodad or something on it there or washers looks like some kind of a spe oh that's what it is it's a spring washers so let me lay it down and uh, the thing the blade circumference is only about four feet so that would make some sense for it to be about a 200 watt to 300 watt turbine with peaks of up to 400 and in what they call extreme crazy psychotic winds and we're going to take this one and we're going to be putting that up and I have got me some old thermodyne green blades which are the very very good green blades have good aerodynamics on them and I'm going to probably hold on to those in case I lose these because I don't know how good these blades are but seem pretty firm and they look 
they look well machined or well made got the little pockets in them so all right time will tell that's just a little opening up of this one this is all that's all cast aluminum guys that's not even plastic I figure I thought that would be plastic hear that here I'll take my Missouri pig sticker and listen that's metal <laughs> That's, that's, that's strange. So, it comes with slip ring. Um, I guess, well, wire size is 12 gauge, so it's, it's kind of advertising its worth right there. Um, they didn't put cheap little 14 gauge wires on it with a little three plug trailer plug or something like some idiots do. So, let's look towards seeing this one. And just a little three blader, because I have a lot of wind in this location, and we'll try it out we'll try it out maybe it works actually that might be shocking but it even comes with a little boots rubber boot thing that you for your clamping down on your inch and a half pole so all right it's uh just called a wind turbine generator a couple hundred bucks so why not all right hope you do right <laughs> had to have one for my rv and i can't have one that throws blades and all that because people would complain very nice we will uh, we will hook this up later to a uh, drill motor and hook these up to a rectifier and see what she does. All right, guys. Wind turbine generator.